Hey, this is a quick video just to tell you if you have an iPhone or an iOS tablet or a watch or anything that runs Safari, so basically any Apple product, then uh, you need to update and you need to update now. Okay, and the reason why is because there has been this, well, this particular update here, it's uh, CVE 2021-30858 and 30860. As you can see, Safari, iOS Watch, OS, Mac OS, and so forth. So yeah, pretty much everything um, from Apple right now. The reason being is that there has been a piece of spyware in the wild since February and it was just found out about now. Um, and uh, that spyware can basically do anything with your device. Um, so you could have somebody in your device looking through your photos, your emails. Uh, somebody could use the camera on the device. Somebody could do pretty much whatever they want. It's a very sophisticated piece of software called Pegasus. So the Pegasus software is written by a company called NSO Group, who are an Israeli firm. Now, Pegasus is a commercial product. It's actually um, <laughs> legitimate. And the reason for this uh, is that what, what it's used by is things like uh, the US government and other agencies um, or very large companes. And it, it, it it's, it's used for targeted um, cases. So... Uh, it will it will exploit a vulnerability on a device, and that vulnerability is not known about by Apple in this case. the The whole point of this Pegasus product is effectively that they don't tell Apple about this; uh, they keep it a secret. However, it's used by um, government agencies, right? So the agreement between this Israeli group, NSO group and um, the purchaser of their Pegasus software is that they don't share the software and it is limited to these spying agencies. So for example, the NSA, the CIA, that sort of stuff, they, they could have this for, I guess, legitimate uh, purposes like counterterrorism, right? So they use this tool to exploit devices on targeted um, particular devices. So if they say that they've got somebody who's uh, perhaps looking to um, you know do something nasty and they want to get the jump on them before they um, they do it then that of course is a legitimate purpose for using software like this um, it's very expensive software and it's proprietary and it is of course um, supposed to be in the hands of actors who are using it for I guess the right reasons now you have to obviously have to put an awful lot of trust into both NSO group for that and obviously the purchaser of that as well. But I think um, NSO are supposed to be very discerning about who they sell it to. So I think NSO are quite confused that this particular exploit has come out into the public um, or, or has is being exploited in the wild, uh, shall I say. So it's... It, they don't know who, who's got it. They don't know who is, who's using it, but they know that the exploit is out there. Um, and I'm sure more information will clear up um, that in, in the future. Well, I hope so anyway. Um, but basically the exploit that we have here um, for all of these devices, you don't have to click a link. You don't have to do anything. Literally just by having your device and having it not, not updated, uh, could have your device with the spyware on it. So updating will remove any spyware if you do have it, and it will patch up that vulnerability on your iPhone. So really, um, really pretty heavy duty vulnerability to have on your device, um, not good at all. So please do go, if you have an iPhone, I don't, otherwise I would show you, but if you go into your settings and go into software updates, just make sure you go in there, refresh that if it doesn't come up immediately because it does come up. Um, I have seen that if you, if you go into software updates, it says there's no updates. If you press the refresh button, uh, it'll actually pull it from the app from the Apple um, updates and will um, update that for you. So if you haven't updated already and you're watching this, then definitely do it because it's already a day old. Um, this is not new news. There's just more news coming out about it already. So I hope this has been helpful. Um, there's much more information on the web about it. Um, so I suggest that you um, read up a bit more about it if you're interested at all. But yeah, um, certainly anything that you have running um, any of these platforms, then I uh, strongly advise you.
Fate. Howl's Geek Lab, signing out.